Hey guys, welcome back to the Dumpster Cash channel. Um, it's gonna be a little bit different tonight. A lot of my footage from the dumpsters lately have been like way too dark to show you guys. Um, so I'm ordering a new flashlight and everything. Um, but I just wanted to make sure that you guys saw what I've been getting. Uh, I've been getting quite a good stuff. Um, so I'm just gonna update you tonight on what I got. Uh, a lot from Bed Bath and Beyond, uh, which is mostly what I got, and then um, pretty sure I only just got like a few other things from other places that were worth crap. Scrap. Um, but if you are new here, go ahead and subscribe, turn notifications on, and go ahead and smash the like on this video. Go for five likes on this video, and then comment down below what you guys think. And I'll see you in the clip. And then after that, you guys can just subscribe, like, comment down below, turn notifications on. And I'll see you in the next shot. This here, let's just get right into it. This here is a cordless bug zapper. Not sure if it works, but I'll update you on that. It looks like it says a cordless bug zapper, but it looks like you can actually plug it in. It has to like charge during the day, and then maybe set it out at night. But that's what that is. Uh, so that's cool. We can actually use this. So we found this basket here. A lot of this stuff is from Bed Bath and Beyond, by the way. And then this isn't everything I found. A lot of the scrap I left in my car. So found this cool basket. Uh, nothing really wrong with it. So <clears throat> actually have a use for that. So that we found this document holder uh, make sure you guys can look so price tag on it $30 not sure if you can see that but it says $30 right there so that's an easy like $10 $20 and I found three of these beach chairs uh, it's like a backpack kind of thing you put on your back unbuckle it all that and I found three of these these are selling right now for about 30 to 45 dollars on eBay so I found that one I found a Tommy Bahama one this is the Tommy Bahama they're a little dirty so I'll just clean them up but they're really nice shape Tommy Bahama relax this is the second time I found one of these but the last time I found one of these uh, it was like broken right here so I'm talking quiet because there's people sleeping, so I'm not trying to. So this is the third one of those, just the normal. Uh, the Tom Bahama one will probably sell for more, just because the Tom Bahama. Uh, fun alarm clock, Timex, thirteen dollars. Get these out of the way. Um, I found. Uh, four of these. There's one curtain in each. It's uh, 108 inches by. It's 50 inches wide and 108 long. Um, I found four of these, and the price tag on them is $60 right there. If you can see it, it's like a teal color, <clears throat> blackout. Um, I'll actually insert a clip of these hanging up because I actually already used two of these. Uh, that's why I only see two here. I'll insert it like right now. So that is what they look like hanging up. We it's awesome that I could I love finding things that we could actually use in the house so there that's two hundred and forty dollars right there let's just put these over here and then let's bring this bad boy down this is a solar powered light like pavilion thing I'm not gonna drag it out now but it says never rust aluminum 11 foot Solar rectangular patio umbrella, aluminum with crank, provides about six hours of light, UV resistant, but 
I'm gonna try to put one that I like find online like on the screen right now so that's what it looks like um, and the price tag on it is about 130 right there so looks like everything's in there so I'll update on you about that I think we're actually gonna use this in our backyard um, <clears throat> they had it on clearance 50% off it was 130 now 65 so I guess they couldn't sell it, so that's probably why I threw it away. Found this solar rack, found two of these. Uh, it's a little chipped right here. That's probably why they threw it away. But, cover it, lights up. Uh, this is like a salad spinner. It says broken. I did look in here, it is broken, just the lid part of it a little bit. Um, pretty easy. I uh, found a bunch of these boxes. I'll just sell them online. These boxes are great for shipping, so I always get money for those. That's just easy money. And these are all empty. These are ones that I'm selling online. That's really easy money. And I, there's plenty of them around. I just get them from the Comcast store. So, I use those for that. I got four of those at like about 10 a piece 40 bucks right there um, I find a lot of co coax and ethernet this is a coax that looks brand new just unraveled got that brown three brand new ethernet cables um, I'm starting a collection of these and then sell them off in lots instead of scrapping them I find that I get more money per per pound for it so coax cable and then some miscellaneous. I think this is a lithium ion battery, maybe. It has to say it on there for me to be able to scrap it, but I'll look it up. See see what I can get for it. This is a splitter. I find plenty of these too. Brand new splitter. Like again, like I said, I just put those in lots and then sell them on eBay when I have like ten or so. I have like I think three right now so got two of these Comcast remotes not bad find plenty of them and then a power brick some extra miscellaneous cords stuff like that so these will just go in my lot Put all this in here and I actually find this all these a lot at yeah. Bed Bath & Beyond, but it's like a scale. Uh, not sure. Oh, there's a leg broken off, that's why. Is there a battery in it? Oh, wow. Okay. So, looks like the only reason they threw it out is because of the leg being broke. Of course, you can't really... You're not really supposed to weigh yourself. An unbalanced thing. It's actually not turning on, so maybe it is broke. I don't know. Yeah, I looked at that. Um, these are part of the curtain rods I found. Uh, let's go on this side. Uh, this is like one of those hot key tea kettles. You plug this bottom part in. Put this on, it warms up whatever's in there, and then you can just pour it out. Pretty cool. <clears throat> found these pumpkin lanterns. The only thing wrong with it, we found a lot of these, but uh, the rest were kind of like really broken. But the only wrong with this one is just this little chip right here. You just cover that up, up with like Sharpie. Looks brand new. Uh, curtain rod. Some red solo cups. This is like some soap dispenser, $50, it says it's missing the soap, it's supposed to come in this thing, but it, I guess it came empty, or it came loose, I don't know, so, found a whole big bag of um, bird feed, and then some miscellaneous cords, and remotes and scrap so um, that's not everything 
some stuff I have in my car still, some stuff I have out there. We found some st good stuff from CBS, so just pay attention to the episode, and yeah. Thank you guys for watching, and let's leave a like on the video. Let's go for five likes on this video. Uh, if you're not subscribed, subscribe down below, turn notifications on, and comment down below what you guys think about the episodes, and yeah, I'll see you in the next one.